You sure you want to do this? I'm sure. I mean, you said it's harmony tradition, so far be it for me to break a tradition. Okay. This is it. This is it? This is the place where we can find out if we're meant to be together forever or not? I don't believe this. This is a joke, right? No. <laughs> Timmy, we have to get that bottle back. Maybe that'll work. Take care of him. I can't. I won't do it. Yes, my son, fight it. What did you say? Fight the evil. If you give in to the evil and do its bidding, you will destroy yourself in the process. I remember you from the book cafe. Your voice is very distinctive. Uh, I, I don't know. What... I warned you at the cafe. Heed my warnings, my son, or evil will destroy you. Oh, with all due respect, I'm not your son, Padre. Of course. I recognize your voice now. You're Alistair Crane's son, Julian. What is this, some bizarre new game? Who's your daddy? Chest, if you must. But you cannot hide your real soul from God. Even now, your father is up to evil, intent on ruining lives in harmony. So what else is new? Get rid of that information immediately. Dr. Russell cannot see the last page. Delete, delete, delete! I'm doing everything I can, Mr. Crane. That's not enough. If you don't stop Eve from seeing this information, I will destroy you. I hear you, Mr. Crane. Eve Russell can never read the results of Chad Harris's DNA match. She must never find out who his real parents are. Mom, what's wrong? Why don't you just scroll down? Dr. Stewart said it won't take a minute. It's just a shortcut, Eve. There's no need to read hundreds of matches when you can just read the summary at the end. Yes, I know. I don't know what I was thinking. This is it, y'all. To find out who my parents are. Come on, Mom, let's see who they are. Breathe in, breathe out. You give me a life. You are my passion for life. <laughs> You can't be serious. What's wrong? This is where we're supposed to go to find out if we're ready to make a commitment? To be together forever, that's right. <laughs> Sally Chin's House of Noodles? It's a harmony tradition. Every happy couple that I've known that's had a successful relationship has come here and passed a test. A Chinese restaurant. Best on the East Coast. All right. This test, I mean... What happens if we don't pass it? No, we will. No sweat. I wish I were that positive. I could worry. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just that I mean, what we have, our relationship, it, it means everything to me. Yeah. It means everything to me, too. You know, Louise, it's just that you've always had love in your life. 
You know, your family, they've always been so supportive and caring. I've never had that kind of love. I mean, you know my family, cold and distant. Except for my mother. She died when I was so young. And this love that we have, it's terribly precious to me. And if I were to find out that I wasn't going to have it forever, I don't think I could bear it. Well, you don't have to worry about that. All the same, I, I think I'd rather pass on the restaurant. Just hold on to my illusions. You know, just keep on pretending that this love that we have will go on forever. would turn and send it back to us, Timmy. Timmy Storm wonder if Timmy and Tubby really should get the ball back. <sighs> stop wondering and start thinking of a way to help. It's just after what Hecuba did to Timmy earlier. Timmy, what's happened to you? What? Why is Tabitha looking at Timmy like that? <gasps> what happened? What the heck you been doing to me now? Oh no, Timmy. You're a goat. A goat? What the heck you been doing to me? <gasps> oh no. What, Tabitha? What the heck you been doing to me now? Maybe she'll just float away and a great white shark will swallow her up. Oh, pity the poor shark that eats that one. Now, oh, it's up to us, Timmy. We have to get that bottle back and make sure that Hecuba stays trapped inside it if she gets out. Oh, I hate to think of all the horrible things that'll happen. Timmy doesn't want to think about it. <sighs> She'll destroy us. Timmy said he didn't want to think about it. Uh, oh, we've got to get that bottle back and put it somewhere safe where she can never get out. <laughs> <laughs> and soon, oh, very soon, someone will come along and find this bottle, become curious as to what's inside, pop the cork, and release me! And when that happens, it will be your last and your worst day on Earth! <laughs> oh, my oh, love. Down the blackboard. Oh. <laughs> if we don't get that bottle back, Timmy, we're done for. <sighs> Let's forget about your father for the moment. <laughs> now who's jesting? One doesn't forget about Alistair Crane. Even for a heartbeat, he won't allow it. Alistair has lost his way, but it is not too late for you, Julian. You can be saved. You must. What was that? Evil. It is here in harmony. You must resist its bidding. If you don't, it will destroy you. This is a bit too bizarre. <laughs> you can run from evil. But if it is in your soul, it will find you. Evil is here in harmony. I can sense its presence. Please, Lord, protect the people here in harmony. Help the people that I love. Guide them. Show them your way so they can make the right decisions in their lives. Decisions that will keep evil at bay. It's gonna be okay. Yeah, I hope so. Because the results of this DNA test are gonna change my life. 
I think that when we find out who your parents are, it's gonna change both our lives. Look at her, Sam. Her hands are shaking. Mom, we're all nervous for Chad. No, Sam, there's something more. She's trying to hide something. Oh, come on, TC. Sam, the fact that she and Julian are Chad's parents. Look, I don't believe it. Because you don't want to, all right? But I got a feeling. Look how she's acting. She was so reluctant to find Chad's DNA test results. Are you sure you're not imagining this? Sam, I overheard her have a conversation with Julian about a baby. What, what's so unusual about that? Come on, they both have children. Sam, it just wasn't a normal conversation, all right? I can't explain it. Look, look, look at her now. Look, she's nervous. And don't tell me she's nervous just because of Chad. I know it's hard, Eve, but you gotta keep it together. Oh, I'm so worried, Grace. If Chad is my son, there's no telling what TC might do. Look, it's not too late. You can still tell TC the truth. Before he sees it on the computer. But what if I'm wrong? I mean, what if Chad isn't my son? Then everything could just go back to the way it was. I could just have my family and TC and the girls. What is taking you so long? It's not me, it's the computer. No excuses, damn it. Destroy the information. Eve Russell must never see it. I'm doing everything I can, I swear, but like I said... If she sees the results of that DNA match, all will be lost. Wait a minute. I know how we can prevent Eve from seeing the last page of the report. Now listen to me, this is what I want you to do. But people could die. I don't care who dies. All I care about is saving the Crane Empire. Now do what I told you. Forget about illusions. We got reality here. I love you, and I'm not about to stop loving you anytime soon. I know that. It's just that what if we were to take this crazy test and fail? I, mean, I, I don't know how I would react, how I would feel. All right, look, I'm so afraid of losing you. you. Sure. You got to trust me about one thing. I would never do anything to hurt you. I do believe And the only that. reason that I even suggested coming here is because we were talking about when a couple knows that they're ready to commit to each other, and I thought this would be fun. You're right. I guess I'm just being silly. No, no. If you're worried, we'll just... And we'll turn around and we'll go. Wait. Do you really think we can pass this test? I'm positive. But if it makes you feel uncomfortable. You are such an incredibly caring man. It, it's amazing how understanding you are. I love you. You come first. I just want you to be happy. It's been a long time since anyone cared about my happiness. Not since Mother died. But you know what? I'm letting fear rule my life, and that is truly silly. So let's get in there and ace this test. No doubt. Nary one. I want to see if we're ready to commit to each other. And let's go see Sally. <laughs> Why isn't it erasing? That idiot of an intern. I'll have him flayed. Be okay. Once Eve gets the last page, you'll see you've been worrying about nothing. She sure is taking her time. For pity's sake, get rid of it now! The next page is the last, Eve. Stop her! No one can see that information. What if somebody dies? I don't give a damn! Kill the power at the hospital right now. Okay. I can turn off the power through my computer. I don't care how you do it, just do it. Yes, sir. Right now. 